30 miles away. The other helicopter has been diverted to a freak gardening accident. FedEx for 999, wonder if you had any further details. Patient's got a large branch stuck in a calf, which is exposing uh, muscle and flesh. The, uh, the branch is still in her leg. It's probably about 10 or 11 inches long. Paramedics Sammy and Sam are being sent to the outskirts of the market town of Selby. Should be slightly right at the nose on the edge of well, this little estate that sticks out. Yes, literally. It's, it's the houses uh, closest to the uh, the back with a person that stood in the white field in the back. Visual. And I, I'm sorry you were overspoken, but we do have a visual with the, the scene making final approach. Over. Pilot Harry is aiming to drop his medical team at the bottom of the patient's garden. For the neighbours, a peaceful bank holiday is over. Oh, it's an easily climbable fence by the way, it's a bar fence. Okay, that'll do, because I don't want to blow down any more trees. Kath Johnston was helping her husband when she tripped and impaled her leg on a broken branch. You want to grab that? Sam's going to take over her care. Hello, so what's your name, love? Kathleen. Hi, Kathleen, I'm Sam. So what's happened? I know I'm in the wrong shoes. Half my leg's on there, and that's in there. Oh, yes. Let's see what you've done. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Can you feel me touching there? Yeah. And down this side? Yeah. So I'll try not to do anything that'll tickle you, because I don't want you to move it, obviously. Yeah, that don't feel... That feels... That feels a bit, a bit numb and a bit strange. There's some nerves and other bits that obviously run down your leg, so I wouldn't be surprised if they kind of bruised them, if they're a little bit stretched or something, because of where it is. Help? We'll oh, we'll obviously have to take it to hospital. I'm not going to... Yeah. I'm not going to do an operation to take it out here. That would seem unnecessary. So we'll put, we'll get um, like a, a splint and basically just put your leg, like put that on your leg just to keep everything kind of nice and still. We'll find out how close the ambulance is or if we've got any available because it's a really busy bank holiday um, and then we'll go from there. But we'll, so we'll, give, you, we'll give you some painkillers, we'll get you comfortable and then we'll worry about all that kind of stuff. Her husband saw what happened. We decided not to do any gardening today because we did such a lot the last two days and then we just said we'd move a pot, which is the big green one there, move it down in between where those two trellises are. So we're carrying it between us, and uh, calf tripped up over the bush that's only been fairly recently pruned, so it's all sharp ends and short. But, yeah, I mean, she's not quite anything, so she's, she's a strong, strong woman. 